Hako was really the shining jewel of the community. I think it was really the centre of Jewish community. And it will be again. At the moment, the community is very segmented and divided. And I feel like a lot of people lack a way to connect to the other groups. Like we're lacking a centre. And I think Hako will really provide that for us. Having a sense of community, a place where we can all come together, is so important for our wellness. I think that having a hub where the Sydney Jewish community can come together to have yoga, Pilates, to go to physio, nutrition, go to the gym, I think it's going to really enhance the heart and the soul of our community. It's just so needed. We don't have a ground, we don't have a space that we can call our own, where we can get together for functions, where our social sport people can meet. Everything is possible to be done there. Having a centre that caters for so many sports is exciting because you could be playing netball on the netball courts and go have a coffee and know that you're going to meet guys from the soccer field or people from the tennis courts. We need a JCC in Sydney. In every city in the world where the Jewish community is strong, the JCC has acted as a nucleus. Hakoa is building the modern facilities to allow us to have those conversations, to have those events, to have those professional activities with parking, with technology, all in the one space. Hakoa is going to be the place to facilitate Jewish engagement, Jewish identity and a sense of belonging. It's very important. We have a cultural home as well. Creative lounges, meeting rooms. We need to operate within a team, within a collaborative framework being around that environment, it'd just be a really fantastic opportunity. For me, it's not about age. It's really about coming together with shared desires and loves, passions and ideas of creating a sense of perpetuity in, in our community. As a young mum, I mean, I've got three little kids under six and my husband and I tried to find a family environment that was similar to the upbringing that I had and our connection with Hakoa. I think if we could contact our friends to say, hey, we're going for dinner tonight, come and bring the kids, we would be there every Sunday night. As a single mum and not growing up in Sydney, I felt isolated. If I knew a place like Akoa existed, where we can connect with other people and feel more support and more integrated and also to transfer the heritage to the kids. I could love fast track the last five years where I was struggling as a single mom. See, I think it's hard just to find spaces to explore creativity, to meet other creative people. I think it will just bring so much more life into our community. I think as a musician, we tend to become a little bit reclusive in our studios. This is a place where we can come together and collaborate and engage with others. It's a place to gig and jam and make friends and be with friends. We have been missing that cultural hub for quite some time now and it's really important that we get it back.